There's nothing we love more than a solid movie about love. But not all films about love have a happy ending. In fact, there are a whole lot of romantic movies out there that are sad enough to make us curl up in a ball and cry for a few hours, lamenting the fate of our favorite characters and wishing we could turn back time on their behalf. As much as we hate to see love stories end in sorrow, we simply can't look away. We know in the back of our minds that most of the characters on the big screens are totally made up, but the emotions and heartbreaks, as well as the wins and losses in love, feel absolutely real. And isn't that what matters? <laughs> we thought so. This is Deidre Ann Johnson, and today we'll be counting down the top 12 Korean romantic movies that are guaranteed to make you cry. We have gathered what we think are the best, and the list is 100% spoiler-free. One thing is for sure. Each of these movies is bound to get those waterworks flowing. So grab your tissues and keep on watching to see which movie you'll choose to make you cry next. Number 12. A Millionaire's First Love This film revolves around a rich teenager who has no respect for anyone and believes the world is controlled by money. A senior in high school, he rarely shows up to class. It's not that he has no desire for success, it's just that he knows he doesn't have to study hard in order to get it. On his 19th birthday, he'll become a millionaire thanks to his late grandfather's inheritance. But the day before the big payout, his family lawyer discovers a hidden clause in the contract. He can only inherit his fortune if he graduates from a high school located in the countryside. The pampered city boy has no choice but to subtly move to this small rural community where his credit card isn't accepted anywhere and he can't even drive his sports car. But amongst all the country bumpkins and backward yokels, he meets a girl in whom he sees something different, something special, something which might possibly inspire him to change his selfish, arrogant ways and become a better person. Number 11. Once in a Summer to make up for her poor performance as an assistant producer, a girl promises to have her reserved but very renowned professor appear in their television series. The show involves locating the long-lost loved ones of the participants' past. Although hesitant at first, the professor agrees to take part. His story takes the assistant back to 1969 when the world is in chaos. While in college, the professor is seen traveling with student volunteers to a remote village in the countryside in an attempt to escape the supervision of his strict father. It is there that he meets a very pretty girl who is the custodian of the only library. He is instantly and completely mesmerized by her. The two connect and get closer, but their bumpy courtship is threatened by dark secrets that she hides about her family and their history in the village. Secrets that will haunt the pair as the volatile political climate catches up with them. Number 10. Be With You Based on a Japanese novel and film of the same name, Be With You follows the story of a single father attempting to act as both mother and father to their young son while mourning the premature loss of his wife. The son, inspired by a fairy tale written for him by his late mother, looks forward to the coming rainy season when he believes his mother will return. Sure enough, someone much like his mother appears mysteriously at the first rain, but she has no memory of the husband and son whom she loved dearly. Number 9. Unforgettable The story kicks off when a radio DJ receives a letter from his first love that brings up almost forgotten memories of the past. Flashing back to 1991, the film then follows the story of five friends, when four of them return to their hometown on an island to spend their summer days with their good friend. She couldn't go to school like her friends because she's ill and limps. Her friends are used to carrying her whenever they want to fool around and have some fun in their free time. Little do they know that this will be their last summer together. This summer is filled with fun, romance, and tragedy. Number eight, always. Having closed himself away from the world, a former boxer starts a new job as a parking lot attendant. During his first night, he's watching the small television in the pay booth. A young woman comes in, mistaking him for the person he replaced. She offers him something and it's at that time he realizes that she's blind. Sensing something sweet and sincere in him, she frequently visits him, sharing his booth as they watch K-dramas. 
Her attention and carefree attitude enable the man to connect with her on a deeper level, leading the pair towards a sweet romance. But his dark past and her misfortunes are intertwined as well. Coming in at number 7, My Love. This film follows four couples, all of whom have different kinds of relationships. The first couple, a subway driver and a daydreamer, share a loving relationship. The second one consists of a college student who asks the student she likes to give her drinking lessons, even though she can't handle alcohol. The third, a career woman who has feelings for a widowed father, but he rejects her advances. And the last pair consists of a free hug activist who returns to Korea to meet his old girlfriend. This is a story exploring the human connection. Number six, More Than Blue. This film tells the story of a radio producer who has loved his friend since childhood, but kept his feelings to himself. One day, he's told that he only has a few months to live. Because he knows that her biggest fear is to be left alone, he keeps his secret and makes a hard decision to urge her to marry a healthy, kind-hearted man so she will not have to be alone after he dies. Number 5. Windstruck This film tells the story of a novice cop who mistakenly arrests a stranger, believing him to be a purse snatcher. With a twist of fate, they end up liking each other. However, just as their relationship begins to blossom, fate steps in to alter things dramatically. Number 4. A Werewolf Boy This film tells the story of a girl who moves to the countryside with her mother and sister. She has a lung ailment, which is why their doctor recommended the move. Soon after moving into their new home, the family discovers a wild boy living in the barn. Wanting the help, the family takes him in, and soon a relationship begins to form between the girl and the boy. Nearing the top of our list at number 3, Daisy. Set in Amsterdam, Daisy tells the story of a love triangle between a young girl and the two men in her life. The young girl, a painter living in Amsterdam, looks after her grandfather's antique shop during the week and earns extra money as a street painter on the weekends. It's through her painting that she meets a handsome young Interpol cop who is chasing a criminal, but he keeps her in the dark about his real work. The other man happens to be a hitman who found a soft spot for this young painter and watches her from afar before making his move. Number 2. A Moment to Remember A Moment to Remember is one of those movies that you just can't help but be emotional watching, covering the story of a fashion designer who is stricken with Alzheimer's disease, which will eventually wipe away her memory. Her husband desperately tries to give her one last memory of their love before it's all gone. A beautiful love story, and one that very well deserves this position in our list. Now, on to the big reveal, number one, the classic. In this film, a young university student finds a secret box filled with her mother's letters and a diary. Reading it, she learns of her mother's first love affair a story which closely matches her own experience at the university. Bouncing back and forth, the film delicately unfolds the two romances of the two generations. Though the times and people differ in these two stories, the classic love feelings remain unchanged. 